Welcome to NZD News. We are your hosts, Donazon and Casper. Today we are gonna talk about two special things and one big achievement for our company and a game. Come up, coming up, number one, Skyrim has just been released. 11 11 11, the most awesome date to pick it up on. Yes, fuck you. Yeah, now, I did that. Yeah, now, yeah. Shut up. Now, Skyrim is part of the Elder Scrolls series, and Elder Scrolls is a RPG series, you know. And it's set in the medieval times with melee, bows, and all that stuff. And dragons, of course. It took five to six years to create this blockbuster, and I can only say to you all people, it is recommended. I just bought it. I think, yes, yes, I got it on release date. Download it. Down, install it and all that stuff. Playing it, it is a great game, great visuals. It's, it has some few bugs and glitches and all that stuff, but I hope they'll get it fixed. But it is a big game, people. This is an open world RPG style game. We have many main quests that take that maybe take 300 hours to complete, and then we also have side quests we can take up to thousand hours of playing time. So like Red Dead. Yeah, I'm not Red Dead Redemption, but it's it's okay game. But I can say Elder Scrolls is a better game because it just fits my playstyle of med medieval uh, kind of things, you know. And you have much much advantage, and you can change. You can. There's so much stuff. Du 90 dungeon, 90 90 handcrafted dungeons and other dungeons are random generated. It is awesome, and I can't say anything about it. You need to play it, and that's the most important part. Okay, go play. I recommend. It. All right, Casper. Time for Minecraft. The yeah, biggest the, game. Mo the most important thing of our news is, or recommended thing, or a recommended game, Minecraft. Yes, the best game of the year. All right. In the year of 2000, 2011, we got several updates and all that, but the biggest update is gonna come in the 18th, 11th, 11 at Minecon Day, as you know, and we're gonna get the full release of Minecraft. Yes. And now, now, what does this mean? Full release, four or three years of development, full development. For this game from 2009 and two years of alpha and beta I remember installing it in and buying it in 2010 just before Christmas or something yeah uh, in alpha we we played it I bought it he sat next to me we sat and played we didn't know shit about it but we sat there played 24 7 and built some awesome homes survival and all that stuff it was fun because we knew and we didn't know shit about it. Then beta came and this dude bought it and we have played it since then. We are in 1.8 now and this time people, it is time for full version. Yes. Yeah. And the full version has included the end man we got in what what is it? 1.8? Yeah, 1.8. The yeah. update. The first but part. now there's going to come come a new map and a new world, and that's the end. The end is primarily the home of Enderman and the new map, Dragon. And the Dragon. He's a boss. Yeah. 100 health points, boss. Boss mob. He is very, very, very hard to defeat. Yeah. So, including there, we got new achievements. That's very awesome. We haven't heard anything about the achievements yet, but. When we do, we're gonna come with an update. So, we got the new games, or the new game mod, and that's hardcore. When you die, your map just gets deleted. It would be awesome if you could use that mod in, what it's called, multiplayer. multiplayer. Right. Just w. poof, and it's gone. Yeah. That would be fun to look at. And we got new biomes, mushroom. And that's very awesome because including the mushroom biome, there is a cow. Moose room cow. It is simply a cow with 
a lot of mushrooms on it and it looks like a mutant. Yeah. And yeah. You, you can also actually use shears on them. Yeah. When you click mouse 2 or mouse 1, I can remember, uh, it will drop three or four m those red mushrooms and then it will just turn out to no normal. But it's still fun to farm or grind the mushrooms. Yeah. That way. And we got new items, Fantasy. Yes. New items and blocks. New items. We get a little bit of uh, nether stuff. Fences, nether fence, or nether rack fence, or whatever it's called. Yeah. Then we also get nether rack, uh, what is it called? Block? Yeah. Yeah, brick. Yeah, brick. Nether brick. Yeah, nether brick. And we can use it to much more building now. So in the nether, this is primarily called the nether update, and it will also improve the nether, of course, make it bigger. What will be in the nether? Will be these items will just come with enhancement table and all that stuff, where you can enchant your stuff, increase your armor durability, make it shine on all that stuff, and it looks just awesome. You can also make your weapons better by that. Enhancement and in the shine and glow. And that makes it very, very fun to play with. And we got the breeding. Breeding. Yeah, breeding. And that is simply you can give the. The animals. You can give the animals wet. Yeah. From and the bread. Then they have. Lover mode. And if another same race of the animal. Is in love mode too. They will have sex together. And like then get a, then like, get a child. Yeah, like That's if you get a uh, sheep, a uh, wheat, a uh, wet wheat, it's called, and you give a uh, sheep one more sheep, uh, wheat, then they get these hearts like a dog, and they begin to go in love mode and go to the, go to the partner, and in seconds they got a baby. Yeah, just That's like all that. Right. And it will be small and then grow eventually in, yeah. in the future. So, coming up also, we have potions and buffs. Potions will give you sometimes increased health or something. And that's also with buffs. Buffs can give you more strength to fight with or more breathe in water. Whatever. More air in water or something. More speed. More running speed and all that stuff. You can view your uh, buffs in, in your inventory. Still, I think you should do that into the hut where you can see your, uh, what it's called, health and armor and all that stuff. It will be awesome, but it can t take time. Of course, buffs are part of RPG style games. So, adventure update, the adventure update, this is the second part, the nether update. It will contain all the RPG stuff we need for Minecraft. It will turn out much more fun. We also get our improved armor system. I don't know much. We don't know much about it because we don't have much information on it. No. But still, we only know that you can enhance it and boost its durability and that and make it shine. So it's awesome. Very, very awesome. And we got new map health rebalanced for the sheep, the zombie, and the spiders. As you know, the spiders, I think they have what too much health because they do so much damage and they're so hard to kill because they can crawl walls and all that zombies are annoying because they just walk into you and do nothing and they take a whole lot of time to kill but this means that you maybe make it harder give them more health because this new can defeat them but you know that's how it is those noobs you know but the sheep, now when you kill them, they... They maybe have lower or more health. Yeah. That's it. But we'll find out that at Minecon 18th November to 19th November. I hope you people will be there, because we aren't going to be there. Oh, we are? No. no. I'm sorry. It's too expensive and really young and all that stuff. But still, we would like to be there. It's going to be awesome for all people. And you got to get capes. Official capes. But we got our own capes, as you can see yes. in the video, in the link right here or something, just over Yeah, the we're gonna, we're gonna find out, you're gonna find out. Yeah. 
Uh, so, information on Skyrim and information on Minecraft full of, full of release and Minecon. Thank you all for watching this video. Please subscribe, like, and comment, and follow me on Tumblr and follow us on Google Plus. It it will give all the latest videos for that. All right, see you everyone, and goodbyes.